1850 million years ago, the second largest meteor hit Earth near Sudbury, Ontario. Today, there is ejecta from that event as far as Minnesota and as near as the History Center galleries. The meteor was estimated to be between 10 and 18 kilometers in diameter. As the meteorite vaporized the bedrock, a cloud of ash, molten rock, and gases formed. This cloud of gas altered the atmosphere, causing iron formation to no longer be deposited. The rock and ash that fell back to the earth are called ejecta. This new display contains impact breccia and lapilli tuff ejecta specimens. Breccia is sharp fragments of rock in a fine-grained matrix. Melted rock spewed from the impact, forming spheres in the air known as lapilli then fell like hail across the region and formed a layer resulting in a rock called lapilli tuff. Here geologist Bob Mahan explained the microscopic view of this ejecta. Certain minerals that are only made by a meteorite impact, there's a special kind of quartz that occurs nowhere else on earth. This quartz can be identified under the microscope and so people started to realize Oh yeah, we've got what we call shock quartz, and that's like the smoking gun. Also new to the permanent galleries is an addition to the Lake Effect kiosk by the Superior Watershed Partnership. Check it out when you stop in to experience the hands-on meteor ejecta display.